Hi everyone, welcome to your Monday stretch break. We are going to do a little something for the forearms, which will help the hands and the wrists. So um, to begin, you can sit, you can stand, you can just let your shoulders be nice and relaxed and take a hold of one forearm. And we're going to twist or sort of wring out from the inside to the outside. And you can do this in a motion, working your way down the arm. So we're twisting in the direction that the hair grows from the inside to the outside. Let's do that once more. Really give that squeeze and twist. And I have my arm kind of up so you can see it. You can do this a little bit lower down so you don't have to work so hard in your shoulders. And as you're ready, release and give yourself just a beat to feel what that may have done for you. So just notice your shoulders. You might even move your hands and wrists around. Like already just a little improvement. Let's change sides and give that ringing out. So we'll squeeze and twist from the inside to the outside. And of course, breathing as you twist. So these are the muscles and the area that we'll give some focus to here in some motion. Go ahead and release. Um, we're gonna come back to the first side. So take your fingers really wide apart and give a little push into the top of the form. You might be able to feel the two bones of your forms. I can't totally feel mine very well, but you might be able to feel yours. We're trying to sink our fingers between those two bones. Okay, your thumb is giving a squeeze on the underside. Now, all you're going to do with that hand is squeeze, release, squeeze, release. And as you get that going, you can move your hand around, squeeze, release, squeeze, release. Keep that going, make a fist with your other hand and circle. Okay, so we're doing a whole bunch of things at once. Squeeze, release, circle, feel, breathe. And just keep moving your squeezy hand around. You might change direction of that rotation. And then let it go, release. And again, give your nervous system a moment to catch up. Notice what that may have done for you. And of course, we'll switch sides. So you can take your fingers wide. We're just going to squeeze, release, squeeze, release. You can get that rhythm going and moving around the form. If you can, kind of sink your fingers between the two bones. And then get your other hand going. Nice loose fist circling around. Thinking really relaxed, melty thoughts here. Change direction. And if there's any last spot you haven't given a little squeeze, you can release, let it go, and enjoy. I hope you're ready to type or uh, squeeze or cook or chop or whatever you're about to do. Okay, see you next week.